Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set up an email forwarding on GoDaddy. So before we start, of course, the first thing that you would like to do is just go and open whatever browser you are going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course in your case, you can use any other browser could be possibly working for you. Once you open that browser, make sure to go into this URL section, simply type godaddy.com and hit the enter button. Of course, that should take you into this page. And if you're facing any issues with the language, as I faced in my first time in this website, you'll have to scroll down until the bottom of it and make sure to change the country or region, which will take the or which will change the language with it. Of course, if you want even to change the currency, that will be possible. So now I will have to go back and log in into your account if you have one. And if you don't have an account, you'll have to go and create one. Of course, you will be able to do both options as this top right corner option, you will find the option to create or even log in into your account. Once you did one of those two options, you'll find yourself on this screen, which is going to be your home screen or your main screen on the Get on GoDaddy website. So as we said in the beginning of this tutorial is we would like to set up an email forwarding on GoDaddy. So once we are logged in into your account, now we'll have to sign in to your email and office dashboard, of course, using GoDaddy website. Of course, simply click at your name at the top right corner and here you'll find an option sign in to office email. Click on it and that should take you into this page. Of course, just log in into your email or if you don't have an email, an email, make sure to click as get started so you can create your email. And once you do that, of course, you'll have simply to select forwards and add a forward. And of course, simply enter a forwarding address to whatever you would like to forward the email to. Then enter the email address you want to forward and then select save. Once you click on save, of course, your new email forwarding address show on the email forward page with the email address it's forwards to. So this will be actually it. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial and goodbye.